going on guys it's your boy javon from jvtv and i'm back with another video for you guys man guys this is not a reaction video but this is a video of me giving you guys my top 10 bands all right for a long time a lot of you guys have been asking me like which band like i should make do a top 10 list like which band is my favorite and uh this is the video guys like this is the video all right so i mean this is only for bands that i've reacted to so far uh guys this was one of the hardest things i've ever done and i mean ever it's like every time i think i have my list completed i forgot a band or um, um you know so hey this is just the raw list as is being my keep in mind guys like this list is subject to change okay like this is subject to change because every day i'm learning about new bands and uh there is some bands that i heard recently i won't give any any hints i'm just gonna leave it at that guys but uh without further ado man we're gonna jump straight into this list i'm gonna start off with number 10 man so for my the band that to me like this band in my opinion man have some of the best guitar intros i've heard man like every time i hear this band like they, their riff every time i hear their riff man i'm like oh yeah this is gonna be a banger this is gonna be good and that band is Leonard Skinner, man. I I know I, I probably caught a lot of people off guard, man. But to me, Leonard Skinner is just that band, man. Uh, I really enjoy their music. I think the first time I reacted to them was when I when I did uh, Freebird, and then I did Simple Man afterwards. And uh, I mean, I'm, I'm just falling in love with them, man. Uh, rest in peace to the members. Uh, yeah, it's tragic, but Leonard Skinner is my number ten band. I'll even. I even roll a clip of my reaction right now. Ooh, Ooh it's sped up. Oh man, that's solo. And yeah, guys, that was uh Leonard Skinner, man. Uh, number nine, okay, number nine. Like this is a band who the first time I heard him from the jump, like. They got me, man. They got me. I, I was feeling the groove. I was feeling everything, man. And uh, that band, guys, drum roll, Dire Straits, man. Hey, I caught a lot of people by surprise, man. But Dire Straits is that band, man. Ah, Mark Knopfler, he's just a genius, man. I, the reason why I like Dire Straits is because I feel like it don't matter what they sing about, like they can make a really good song out of anything, man. Uh, that's just in my opinion. Like they can make anything sound good, man, and make you vibe to it. And uh, that's really impressive, man. I I'll, I'll, I'll leave a clip, a short clip. Roll it. Oh my God. And yeah, guys, that was uh, that was Dire Straits, man. Uh, that was my number nine, my number eight. Okay, now this band, oh man, I, 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 after hearing their earlier stuff, it just nothing compares, man. Now, that band is Chicago. All right, shout out to Terry Cat, man. Rest in peace to him. Uh, when I heard Twenty Five or Six to Four, man, they they definitely hooked me in and showed me who they are. And uh, even some of their later '80s stuff, man, I really enjoy. I mean, a lot of you guys don't like it, but like songs like "You're You're the Inspiration" and all those like songs when they when they try to kind of switch from what they used to be, I still enjoy them, man. So uh, my number eight guys is Chicago. I'll play a little sample clip up above. And uh, yeah, guys, we're back again, man. Uh, so the list is getting lower and lower and lower. Now keep in mind, guys, some of these, some of these lists, uh, bands, especially once I get to my top five, like they could all the placements don't really matter to me, man. Because I, I think, I, except for number one, I think all of them could be like, you know, they could all like take over each other to me, guys. That's how hard it was to me. All right, number seven, guys. Number seven is a band, man. I swear, I, no one can tell me nothing, man. The Eagles, 
Wow, I remember the first time I heard the Eagles when, when I did a reaction to Hotel California. Uh, what, what hooked me to this band is the amazing vocals, the way they harmonize with each other, man. Like, I enjoy every single Eagles song, man. It pains me to have them at number seven because this is super hard. But, hey, to me, guys, like, if there was no numbers, like, they would be in my, in my top five. They would be, like, further, further back in the list, further down in the list, man. Further up in the list, I should say. Uh, the Eagles is really awesome band, man. I really enjoy their music. Uh, I'll leave a little clip up above when I did my Hotel California reaction. And yeah, guys, we're back again, man. The list is getting smaller and smaller and smaller. All right, now we're at number six. So, okay, number six, this band, um, they were in the top five at first, but then I started, you know, I, I get that phase where I'm like, I, I remember more bands, and I'm like, wait. I'll just say, no, this, this band could definitely be in the top five, man, because I really enjoy their music. And uh, if you could guess that, number six is... Rush, man. Like, wow, this band is incredible, man. And the more and more I hear from them, the more and more I fall in love with Rush, man. I think my favorite Rush song right now is called is Spirit of Radio. Uh, I'll, leave, I'll, I'll, leave a little, I'll leave a little clip, man. Roll it, man. But yeah, guys, Rush, man, awesome band. Uh, rest in peace to Neil Peart, amazing drummer. Uh, it's a band I really enjoy, man. All right, guys, so now now we're getting into top five territory, man. A lot of you guys are, like, try, trying to figure out. But right now, it's like, write down in the comments right now, like, what do you think my top five is going to be? Like, what do you think? Who you think is in my top five right now? Like, right now, down, the, down below in the comments, I want you guys to write down who you think is in my top five. All right, so number five. Number five, man, is a band. Um, I, I'll, I'll say that they're underrated, uh, but to me, man, their music has just been bangers after bangers after bangers. From Baba O'Reilly all the way through, man. The Who, you guessed it, man, The Who. I really enjoy this band, man. Like To me, this band is just incredible, man. Uh, man, like... Let's roll the clip, man. Let's roll the clip. Yeah, guys, I'm the same, man. From Keith Moon, Pete Townsend, like the Roger Daltrey, man. This band is tacked too, guys. Like I really, I really enjoy the Who. Uh, the list is getting smaller and smaller, guys. It's going down, so I'm going to repeat it again. Number 10, we have Leonard Skinner. Number 9, we have Die Straits. Number 8, we have Chicago. Number 7, we have the Eagles. Number 6, we have Rush. Number 5, we have The Who. Okay, so now, number 4. I don't know if you guys might be surprised by this, but man, number four, I, I might have to go ahead and say the Beatles, man. Uh, this was really, really hard, guys. This was extremely hard. Because the Beatles, to me, man, are so so impactful to the music that we have today, man. The Beatles, to me, will always be a revolutionary band, man. They're really... Man, I really enjoy their music, man. And there's still so many Beatles songs that I, that I haven't heard yet that I still have to hear, but... From what I've heard and what I've reacted to, so, reacted to so far, man, the Beatles are just it for me, man. Uh, I, I think if there's any of my reactions left, that is, because they usually get blocked. Uh, I'll roll a clip of one right now. And, uh, yeah, guys, uh, we're back again, man. Um, awesome band, the Beatles. Uh, okay, so these were number four. So we're getting to number three. 
Like, who do you guys think is number three, man? Who do you think is number three? Number three could be no other than Queen, man. Like, Queen is my number three band. Like, I started, I started reacting to a lot of Queen, man. Queen is just amazing, man. Rest in peace to Freddie Mercury. Uh, I think I fell in love with this band when I heard Bohemian Rhapsody, man. After that, I just had to listen to more. And then I found myself listening, listening to more and more and more and more. I just fell in love with Queen, man. Ah, oh, Freddie was just an awesome, amazing front runner, man. And uh, this this band, I really enjoyed it, man. I really enjoyed this band a lot. Uh, they definitely, I haven't done a Queen reaction in a while, and uh, I need to, guys. I definitely need to. But Queen is my number three band. I th I I think I roll a clip right now of one of the reactions that I did. I'm ready for it. Let's get it! Let's get it, Freddie! Let's get it! All right, guys. So number two. We're getting closer to the number one, man. Number two. Who do you, who do you guys think is number two, man? Like who do? Right now, I want you guys to guess who is number two. Man. Right now, I'll wait. I'll wait. Let's guess. Who do you think is number two? All right, that's enough time, man. Number two is Pink Floyd. I can't speak high, highly enough for this band, man. Like, I huh, no, man. The Dark Side of the Moon was some of the like just straight masterpiece, man. Like. I listened to it from the beginning to the end, and I just wanted more and more and more. Like, Pink Floyd is just such an amazing band, man. Uh, there's so many of their songs that I really enjoyed. Uh, shout out to David Gilmour. Uh, Roger Waters, man. Like, Pink Floyd is just an awesome band. I'll roll a clip of a Pink Floyd reaction I did. And all right, guys, we're back again. Last but not least, man. Uh, why am I saying last but not least? Number one. All right, but but before I list number one, I'm going to repeat them again so you guys can know who they are. So number 10, Leonard Skinner. Number nine, Dire Straits. Number eight, Chicago. Number seven, The Eagles. Number six, Rush. Number five, The Who. Number four, the Beatles, number three, The Queen, I mean Queen, number two, Pink Floyd, and number one could be no other than Led Zeppelin, man. Uh, I know I caught a lot of you guys off guard with that. Hey, man, Led Zeppelin to me, man, is one of the, I don't know, man, I, enjoy, I really enjoy Led Zeppelin, man. Like, all the songs that I ever reacted to, starting from Stairway to Heaven all the way down, have just been absolutely amazing, man. Like, Led Zeppelin is a band. It's like a powerhouse. Oh, man. With Robert Plant, his vocals are just some of the strongest I've seen in rock and roll. Um, I got a shout out to John, John Bonham and that bass, man. And uh, Jimmy Page and that guitar, man. This band is extremely solid. And don't forget John Paul Jones, man. Uh, this band is just one of my favorite guys. Uh, and that is my list, man. Led Zeppelin number one. I had so many Led Zeppelin reactions. I just play a. And uh, yeah, guys, let's so keep in mind, like, this list is subject to change, all right? Every day, I'm learning about a new band, and uh, I think that's that's really amazing, man. That's really amazing. Uh, I wish I had done a top 20, man, but hey, maybe i do a top 20. That way, you guys can know other bands that, might, that got left off. But this was extremely hard. And uh, I really want to know down in the comments, like, what uh, what are you guys, what's your favorite, what's your top 10 band right now? Uh, right now down in the comments, I want you guys to write me, what's what's your top 10? I really want to hear your top 10. But, uh, yeah, everybody has their own opinion. Uh, I don't think people should, like, bash someone for enjoying, uh, for listing their top 10. And, and they, they might not be your top 10, man, but this is my top 10. Uh... 
some some notable bands that I left off, man. Um, the Rolling Stones, uh, Lonesome Loser, uh, ACDC, uh, The Doors. Some notable bands that I left off, man. But hey, but for right now, guys, this is it for me. And I'm hearing, yeah, like I said, man, this list is subject to change. I'm hearing so many new, great new bands every day. Hey, some of these bands are getting knocked off, man. It might be some of these bands might be getting knocked off. Um, I think my next. Uh, my next list or top 10 would be like my top 10 or top 20 favorite songs that I've reacted to so far or uh, it could be metal bands or it could just be artists or you know there's gonna be like more top lists to come because I, I think these are like engaging you know uh, I don't know I kind of like I kind of like doing this man even though it's hard and challenging I know something different something new um, but yeah you guys let me know what you want to see next down below and uh, yeah, don't forget to leave your top 10, man, because I'm going to read it and, you know, interact with you guys down in the comments. But uh, yeah, guys, let me know what you think of my top 10. If it's if you guys think it's trash, if you think a certain band deserves to be somewhere else, in your opinion. Like, hey, man, I just want this to be as open as possible. But uh, yeah, guys, that's it for now, man. It's been your boy, Jay. Hope you guys are all staying safe, and I'll see you guys in the next one, man. Peace. Essa daqui é pique, hein?